Hello, all my naughty nymphs, perverted pimps, and everybody else not sitting on a pillow. You, hello. <laughs> hello, all my naughty nymphs, perverted pimps, and everybody else not sitting on a pillow. You reached the flip side. Had my pinky over, I think, the mic. We'll check out. But regardless, if you heard it twice, you heard it twice. How we doing? Oh, my goodness. It's been a decent day, you know. Not too hot, not too cold. Uh, temperature pretty much all the same throughout the day because of all the cloud over the top that have uh, kept the temperature from rising and lowering. Ah, it's been a nice day. I've got I've got a raw glass with uh, water. I've got a shiner light blonde. That's uh, actual beer. <laughs> I got my cigar pack, my Philly Sweets. I've got my uh, USS Theodore Roosevelt um, uh, Zippo that I actually got at a yard sale. And uh, uh, I don't know, about a decade-ish ago, and it still had the sticker on it. It was never used. I paid a dollar for it. Now somebody during my yard sale stole my black uh Zippo that my dad had found in 1969 on Highway 199 at the very first racetrack the day they opened. He went there in his 1967 Canary Yellow Camaro with the black stripe. It was a racer. He fixed it up and hyped it up. And he stopped there to get gas and found it on the ground. And it was a brass metal with black all over it. So it had the little edges, the corners and stuff were kind of scraped up a little bit. You couldn't even see the date on it. And he gave it to me three years ago. He died two years ago in January, not from COVID, but uh, he gave it to me three years ago, told me the story of how he found it. And I had it for three years. And then apparently somebody thought it was more important than anything else I had in the yard sale. And they came and it didn't even take the, you know, look just like this, except it was a black Zippo. So they didn't take my pack of, of cigars. So it most likely wasn't a kid. So... And that was the only thing I taking. I had some pretty valuable shit. So, oh well. They say karma, blah, blah, blah. I'll find them. I'll figure it out. Uh, but on my last video, I was sitting there trying to tell y'all something. And you, YouTube and or the CIA or the FBI or the NSA or the Homeland Security less or the this IS or the that IS or the FE this or the FB that or the NS this or the NS that the other or the CI wish or the CI want or dark the dark uh, the dark state I guess nobody probably knows that much about the dark state somebody decided to uh, uh, turn off one portion of what I was saying at the end of the video I don't know if it was my phone or something happened or I was in a bad area that didn't have a good antenna and there was a lot of clouds, so it was stopping all the signals coming from and going to the, uh, the satellites. If, if you know that goes through that direction as well, which I think it does, regardless, or even just the high, the you know the high uh, moisture rated clouds that were so thick that, that you know they just probably blocked a lot of what was coming from the uh, from the uh, uh, antennas. So who knows? But regardless. Um, I guess I'll try to remember what I was trying to say so that y'all hear it on this one. We'll see if they block it again. <laughs> I never once, hello, I never once uh, before I cracked my head in 2018 on March 5th, my front lobe bled for 24 hours and blah, 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 et cetera, et cetera. Uh, y'all hear all that on the other story. I never once told anybody I was special before that. I mean, special forces. And what I did do is 